Welcome back to Doctor of Solutions and today I will talk to you about the hydrogen water. What is the hydrogen water? Hydrogen water is a pure water infused with the ex extra molecular of, uh, of hydrogen. Uh, so you can purchase the hydrogen water in some stores or you can make it at your home or even on the road in your car. So you can produce it by using small oxygen, uh, hydrogen generators. So how the uh, hydrogen water acts on your body? Look at this example. So, if you can see, if you put the nails in the hydrogen water, in the regular water, or highly oxidative water, so you will see the nails will not rust in hydrogen water. Why is that? Because hydrogen water doesn't have high oxidative potential. What is oxidative potential? Let's see the research, how the research uh, says about the hydrogen water. Hydrogen X is therapeutic antioxidants by selectively reducing cytotoxic oxygen radical species. Uh, what is the free radical oxygen uh, radical species? And let's see how they act upon our body. So as you can see, that's what it calls oxidative stress. And oxidative stress damages our, uh, our blood cells, can damage your tissue, it can damage the organ in a high volume within your blood. So how do we uh, how do we get to the high um, high free radicals? So here is the example of uh, formation of free radicals. As you can see, there is uh, UV light. We have all kind of pollutions redu uh, producing free radicals. Ionizing radiation, not necessarily the uh, that's nuclear power, but all EMF, pretty much ionizing radiation. Smoking and all air pollutions. Uh, metabolism, what kind of metabolism? All sugar metabolism producing, naturally producing uh, free radicals. Uh, inflammation caused by uh, causing the free radicals. So, and right now, you, as you know, most people do have um, inflammation, different forms of inflammation. Okay, if you drink the hydrogen, what will happen in our body? As you can see this, so the hydrogen combines with the hydroxyl radicals, which is free radicals, okay, and producing simply, simply the water in our body. So it's safe to drink hydrogen water. So how you can benefit from it? Okay, look at this. So and who can benefit? Hydrogen is a simply, simply says it's a beauty water because it has uh, minus ORP and we're going to measure it today and I will show you uh, the, the readings on the hydrogen uh, uh, generators. So who can benefit from it? Pretty much everyone. Uh, tired from stress, stress producing, uh, free radicals, uh, pregnant women, even infants and babies, pretty much everyone who has a lot of, uh, a lot of stress, a lot of demand on the body uh, so, and we pretty much live in this is, this is stress, very stressful world, so we can, we can benefit from hydrogen, hydrogen water. Um, obviously you will ask how much you can drink, what's the safety, uh, safety dosage on the hydrogen. As you can see, so you can, you can drink almost as much as two liters of hydrogen water. And uh, I will we're going to test it and I will show you how to monitor your body pH um, and that will tell you how much water you should drink. So when you drink the hydrogen water and this is, uh, next slide please, um, your urine will become alkaline. We do offer pH strips on our website it's available on the website. So it's urine pH and saliva pH strips. That's what it looks like. That's the chart. Okay. And you can purchase it. So how you apply it to uh, drinking methods of hydrogen water, it's very simple. You drink the hydrogen water and you monitor your pH urine. Uh, for instance, you had a breakfast and um, you you eat some sugar or, or fast acting carbs or you eat meat or you eat any type of protein 
and then you test your urine maybe about 40 minutes later and it most likely will become acidic so you start drinking hydrogen water and you monitor every urine every sample of your of your urine so and you will see after about three four uh, hours after drinking the hydrogen water assuming you, you sip slowly but every hour you will see your urine will become alkaline so normal uh, pH of urine if you collect urine during the whole 24 hours period the healthy urine, uh, pH of urine range from 6.2 to 6.6 .6 by pH scale a lot of people have a very acidic urine 5.5 5.8 some I saw have urine 4.7 or 4.6 is extremely acidic uh, again coming back to the previous slides so as you know uh, that um, our body is producing free radicals and, as, and, and it's producing pretty much with every food but uh, whole vegetables and green juice if you do that if you if you drink green juice your urine may become alkaline but most of the time you will see urine will be slightly acidic uh, so when you're drinking the hydrogen water and you monitor you will see your urine will become alkaline and this is a perfect uh, a perfect spot to have like 7.0 7.2 and continue it till the end of the day and that's that's how you monitor how hydrogen water acts upon your body so but right now let's do this let's let's produce some hydrogen water and we test the hydrogen water and so you will see uh, the uh, uh, alkalinity and uh, what we will measure we will measure ORP which is oxidative reduction potential with the meter before and after and uh, I would like to tell you so that not every hydrogen generator water generator is is the same it's not producing needed uh, ORP so why would we measure ORP why would not we measure uh, this examples of, of dissolved hydrogen we test many different kits unfortunately most of them do give different readings and, and they are not reliable that I would say you don't use that that's expensive number one and second don't give um, uh, needed needed tests so we will take ORP meter and if you buy you can buy ORP meter from us you will you will find it in, on our website uh, ORP meter have, has to be calibrated before you're measuring it and let's measure uh, the water before and then we, we, we measure uh, the water after so this is distilled water we put this is Dr. O uh, hydrogen uh, water generator and this is just off the market we took some samples and uh, I would like to, to show you the difference so the regular distilled water why we use distilled because again as distilled water is the neutral water and the clean water so that absorb hydrogen very rapidly so let's put ORP meter in, uh, in distilled water and we'll start counting we'll wait As you can see it's about 200 that's uh, the normal range of distilled water between 200 and 250 plus 200 and 250 millivolts as you can see it will jump well if I move as I move it uh, so it's gonna keep keep uh, counting and then stops and counting again as you can see it's is the same so it's the same batch that's why it's about 200 as you can see Let's start both batches and, you, and they will start producing hydrogen water. 
So they do work a little differently. As you can see, this is start bubbling. This is bubbling as well, but producing like fog, foggy, foggy like bubbles. As you can see, it's some fogs appear. So we'll we'll start. You just simply put put the start button, and it start. As you can see, generated bubbles. This is very tiny bubbles. This is larger bubbles. You can see bubbling much faster. Uh, and the cycle continues for about three minutes. As you can see, so we continue to bubble it. Uh, this is produces small and large bubbles, and this keeps fogging. So folks for this video please uh, like us and uh, click the, the, the bell if you would like to, uh, to subscribe us, uh, please do so and I'll see you in the next video.